welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be on this super dramatic green smoky cut crease look i think it's like super like kind of festive you know it's the holiday season so why not go all out before anything don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit that bell button down below so you guys can always get notifications for when i post and without any more talking let's just get right on into the tutorial Okay, so the first thing I'm going to be starting with is my Urban Decay Primer Potion, and I'm going to be priming my eyelids like always. The palette that I'm going to be going in today is the Morphe 35O palette. O2 palette, sorry. And the first color I'm going to be dipping into is this color and this color right here. Now I'm going to go into my Maybelline the City Mini palette and this is the Urban Jungle palette. I'm going to be taking this like army green shade right here and I'm going to be putting that into my crease. And I'm going to take my mm, Morphe M139 brush. I've never used this shade before, so let's hope it works. Okay, guys, it's showing up, but it's like not what I need it to be, you know? It's like it's too dark. I'm just like patting it. Now I'm just gonna take um, my blending brush that we used before and just blend out the harsh edges because we do have some harsh edges right now. I'm gonna take um, this Certify Tropical Wonders palette and I'm gonna take this green right here called Swamp. And I'm going to put that the same place I put the darker green because I want to like lighten up that green. And I'm actually packing on that shade instead of like sweeping it into the crease because I really, really want it to be nice and pigmented. And I'm also going to take a black eyeshadow. And go ahead and smoke this lower lash line, slightly bringing it up into the outer third of the eye, but not bringing it up any further than that. Because I want it to be like an ombre gradient, smoky eyeliner. I'm going to take that Morphe brush from before with no excess product and really, really blend the edges between the green and the black so it's like literally so seamlessly blended. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with some, now I'm gonna go in with some concealer and clean up this eyeshadow. I'm using the ColourPop concealer and now I'm gonna cut my crease. I'm not cutting it all the way like I always do. Now I'm gonna go in with a super small um, detailing brush and I'm gonna go in with that army green shade and I'm just gonna go ahead and define this crease right here a bit just a little bit I'm gonna go in with that same army green and I'm kind of like bringing it super into this white right here and blending it in because I kind of want this to be like a smoky look. I'm 
Then I'm gonna go in with some more black shadow. And just clean up what we have here. Now I'm gonna take my favorite um, eyeshadow ever, and it's the Urban Decay Space Cowboy Shadow. And I'm gonna take my finger and pop that right over top of the white shadow. So it can be nice and popping. Now for the lower lash line, I'm gonna take that same Army Green shade from the Maybelline palette and take this shade right here and I'm gonna bring it onto the lower lash line. I'm just picking up some of that Swamp shade and I'm kind of like pressing it onto the lower lash line. For the inner corners, I'm going to, hmm, what should I use? I'm going to take this gold shade right here and pop that in my inner corner. I'm going to be applying these lashes from Pure Cosmetics and these are alert lashes. They're so pretty. So pretty and the packaging is gorge. Like, come on girl. Okay, now that the eyes are done, it's time to move on to the face. Um, I did change the lashes though because they weren't big enough. So I'm wearing my Shania lashes from Bahi Cosmetics. And they are coming back very soon. I'm not completely sure about the date, but um, if I find out, I'll just insert the date right here. And I do have an affiliate code. It's just a makeup by Shania. And you guys can save some coins on your purchase at checkout. So... I'm going to be taking my Maybelline Master Prime Primer and I'm going to apply this all over the face. And guys, my eyes are like a little bit red, but I tried to like apply contacts earlier and it was not working. But the contacts that I was wearing, the contacts that I was wearing was from the brand Desio. You can't even see it, but... Yeah, it was from the brand Desio, and the color that I had was Delicious Honey. It looks like this. And I'll insert a picture for you guys of what the contacts looked like in. But I only had one in because um, I put in the other one, but like it kept moving because my eye was too watery. So, so for foundation today, I'm going to be wearing my, of course, the Becca Ultimate Coverage Cream Foundation in the shade Sienna. And I really, really like this foundation. You guys already know how I feel about it if you've been watching me. Um, yeah, it's like super full coverage and I really like the color of it. Okay, now that my face is looking flat AF, I'm gonna take this um, new contouring product that I really wanted to try out today. This is the Black Up Contouring Stick. And I got this in the shade, I just got this in the darkest shade that they have. And I'm gonna contour with this today. It's dual ended, it has, um, I think this is like a lighter contour shade and this is a darker contour shade. But I'm gonna use the darker one obviously because the lighter one is like my skin tone okay it's really dark whoa and for concealer today i'm gonna use my color pop concealer in the shade golden 60 
Now I'm gonna blend out my under eye concealer with a brush. And I'm using this Real Techniques domed eyeshadow brush. And I'm just like stippling it in so it doesn't get like any streaks or anything. Now I'm gonna go in with my foundation brush and blend right over top of everything. I'm gonna take, of course, my Maybelline Fit Me Loose Powder in the shade Deep. Now I'm just gonna go in with a brush and just set that all in place. I'm going to take my Morphe 35P palette and I'm going to take these darker brown shades and set my contour. For highlighter today, I'm going to be using this Sam Marcel highlighter palette. And I've never used it before, so it's new to me. Um, and I'm going to be using the shade called Tress Chic, which is which is this more golden shade that would be better for my skin tone. And we're going to use that today to highlight the face. So guys, this is the finished look. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. I'll be leaving all the products that I used in the video in the description bar down below. And you can follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat. All will make it by Shania. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.